We want to make sure that 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 what we do it does not create a scenario under which we have to reverse course. Well, we just heard the county's plan in Peter Dench's report, but the mayor of the city of Miami says not so fast. They'll be taking more time before determining when to start opening things up in Miami. Mayor Francis Suarez says he is consulting with the Surgeon General and other medical professionals before opening things up in Miami. CBS 4's Jessica Vallejo has more tonight from Miami. We are doing this intelligently, methodically, and we're also uh, taking our time. In a virtual press conference held on Monday, Miami Mayor Francis Suarez announced they will not be opening their parks, waterways, and golf courses just yet. But they are approaching the idea with caution as they develop a three phase plan. And in order for phase one to even be implemented, three things would have to happen. The first is that there's a downward trajectory in symptoms, influenza like symptoms, and a downward trajectory in COVID-like syndromic cases. Uh, secondly, that there's a downward 14-day downward trajectory of actual new cases. And thirdly, uh, that uh, in terms of hospitals, that we are able to treat all patients without crisis care. They are relying on health expertise to analyze COVID-19 data in the city of Miami. And while the county may be opening their marinas, parks, and golf courses within a week. One of the concerns is, uh, you know, policing. And we want to look through uh, the county's plan. Some of the, the uh, requirements um, are going to be, uh, I think, complex to patrol. But I obviously, they've decided they're going to hire, you know, multiple hundreds of people to patrol uh, their parks. And that's something that we're going to have to look at in terms of cost. As we mentioned, the first to open will be open public spaces like the parks, waterways and golf courses. Beaches will remain closed as of now. Entertainment places like the movie theaters and restaurants would open in the second phase and places like fitness centers would open in the third. But a 14 day period of observation would take place before proceeding towards the next step of the plan and it's all to prevent a second wave. We're still going to be requiring that people and, 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 of course, urging people to wash their hands, use sanitizers, avoid face touching, using face coverings in public, particularly when using public transportation, and staying home if they're sick and contacting their doctor. Uh, unless, unless and until we have a vaccine, we need to respect this new normal. And while the city hasn't come up with a detailed plan just yet, they are considering lifting their curfew and shelter-in-place order soon. In downtown Miami, Jessica Vallejo, CBS4 News.